Hello there, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to Hearthstone Arena. My name is Rob. Uh, last time we had Lord Jaraxxus. Um, I have actually played... I'm going to turn this down now. I have played a couple rounds between Arena, the last episode, just for fun. Okay, so we can go with Warrior or the Shaman. I'm going to go with the Warrior, because we did Warlock last time, and every time I play as a Shaman in Arena, I lose. So, yeah. Okay, first off is Warrior. Um, Demolisher, probably, actually, no, let's go Wild Pyromancer, because we might get a bunch of, um, stuff that gets enraged and all that. Uh, definitely not Secret Keeper, it's between Emperor Cobra and Ravenhold Assassin. Let's go Emperor Cobra. Uh, okay, Court Corner Elite is pretty good, so it's Fairy Dragon. We already have a two. Let's go Corcoran Elite. Venchko. Or Fiery War Axe is probably better than Venchko, I think. So let's grab that. Now we can get the Fairy Dragon. Um, the Fraumar Farsia, I guess. It's better than the other two, at least. Uh, Boulder Fist. Let's grab the Boulder Fist over Cleave. Rampage. I like Rampage. It's it's quite low on the list, but I uh, I like it. Let's go Cruel Taskmaster as well. Although Arafi Weaponsmith is generally the better thing to do, so let's do that instead. Um, Twilight Drake. Yeah, let's go with Twilight Drake. Uh, Silverhand Knight I love. Bloodsail Raider is good, because we got the weapons. Uh, let's grab another Boulder Fist, just to be super beefy. Acidic Swampoos is a good 2-drop. Uh, Corcoran Elite again. It's a nice card. Uh, Shattered Sun Cleric is excellent. Cruel Taskmaster I will get this time. In a Rage, I will get. Whirlwind? I don't know if I want that. Coltmaster is probably a better choice. Emperor Cobra. Probably better than the other two. Yeah, so we've got two Emperor Cobras. Maybe I should take the Destroyer first. Mortal Strike or Sunwalker? Sunwalker, I think. Uh, Iron Fuel, Iron Fur, Grizzly, because we don't really want too many more high cost minions. Dark Iron Dwarf, Cruel Taskmaster, again, excellent. Another Silver Hand Knight? Sure. Uh, Stranglethorn Tiger, Slap, no, Raging Worgen, because that works really well with Cruel Taskmaster and Inner Rage. We've got two Silver Hand Knights. So let's grab another Rampage, and another Cruel Taskmaster, and Frothing Berserker. Excellent. So I'm feeling quite good about this, actually. We've got... Well, if you count a Fiery War Axe as a turn 2 drop, which it kind of is, we've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 2 drops. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 3s. 1, 2, 3... Four, five, six, fours. I th I feel like this is a nice mana curve, and we've got some good synergy with the frothing berserkers and the rampages and all this. So hopefully, we'll be able to get a few nice wins out of it. Also, another reason for picking the warrior is I'm trying to sort of spread out all the classes I choose because now that I've done the warrior, it means that I've done I think seven out of the nine classes, and I've just got. Shaman and Hunter to go. So yeah. Okay, probably get rid of everything. We'll keep the Frothing Berserker there. So uh, it's a potential two uh, turn two play or yeah. Although why or Pyromancer turn what? No, maybe. Hmm. Just thinking, if we get fair, or if we got wild pyromancer out, yeah, okay. So let's go wild pyromancer, no, fairy dragon, just in case he's got some sort of removal. Although we won't be able to target it, because so. if we go fairy dragon, wild pyromancer, frothing berserker, and then the next turn we have a spell. Shit. So yeah, he did have some sort of removal, so it was good that I. Uh, because I want my wild pyromancer out. 
um, my Pyromancer, and then Frothing Berserker, I guess. Wanna blow something up? Oh, come on. Um, right. Does he have something to take it out? Please no. Please no. He does. Fuck. Okay, so he's kind of just been <laughs> killing everything I've just sending out. Let's bring out the Frothing Berserker now. And if he does attack it, then we can rampage it next turn and make it into a... It'll be a 7-4. Which is not bad. But of course, he might be able to kill it. Which would be annoying. To say the least. He's, he's just had a lot of removal. He's been able to get rid of my stuff pretty efficiently. Okay. At least now... Oh no, he's going for my face. Interesting. Oh. So how about Inner Rage? Rampage. And then I go for his face. Because he's going to send both of his guys into me next turn, I expect. Because two threes is going to take that out. But yeah. That's pretty nice. Um, so, I expect Stranglethorn Tiger's going to be what we send out next time. Ah, uh, fucking hell. We don't have some way to deal with that Dust Devil. We're going to be losing... Losing six health next turn. Or well, eight, actually, with the guy. And here we go. Kind of annoying that we have to... Oh, shit, I didn't even think about that. I didn't think it would kill it for some reason, I wasn't thinking. Oh dear. Alright. Okay, Sunwalker. Sunwalker's the thing to do now, I think. Yeah. Sunwalker. Then next turn we can go Emperor Cobra, Corcoran Elite, or we can go... Strength on Tiger armor up, or potentially something else that uh, we're going to draw. Now. Okay, fair enough. Does he have some sort of kill move? Fuck. Okay, that's annoying. Um, let's send out Emperor Cobra. And Corcoran Elite. Justice shall because hopefully I'll be able to take him out with the Emperor Cobra. Actually, the Emperor Cobra will take it out. Yeah, I don't know. I'm just hoping that he can't take out the Sunwalker with uh, some removal. Because if he does, he's going to clear my board. Or he's going to take out the Corcoran Elite. And then I'll take him out with the Emperor Cobra and I'll have nothing left. Of course, he might have... um. Lightning Storm, which would totally screw me over here. I got the best deals anywhere. Um, what, what's the cost on Lightning Storm? I think it's quite low because it's an overload. Oh, Fork Lightning. Phew, I thought that was it for a second. Ah, uh, come on. Shit. Come on, you know what you have to do. Unless you've got something which costs... Kill it for one mana. I mean, one, do one damage. Oh, okay. Okay. That is annoying. Yeah. Shit. Oh my god. Well played. That's not good. That is not good for me. Can he do anything else this turn? No. Okay. Cruel Taskmaster. 
Not really. Worth it. And let's bring out the Swampoos for the hell of it, I guess. <laughs> because actually, I could use the Taskmaster to take out... Uh, to use the Taskmaster on the Ooze to take out the Fire Elemental. Which would be quite good. I think he's probably going to take the Fire Elemental out. I mean, oh my god. I'm going to take out the Swampoos with his... Um, uh, his goblin. His goblin. Okay. He's got way more cards than I do, and he's got a better board, I think. Let the pain <laughs> he's just bringing everything out, isn't he? Now, he is. Fuck, he's gonna clear my board. Okay. Uh, well, at least I can get rid of him. And I can get rid of him. And then I'll armor up. Okay, so that's not too bad. Um. Yeah. Okay, so that's not so bad because that's going to destroy the acolyte of pain now. And is he going to do? What's he going to do? Probably bit my cruel taskmaster. Oh fuck! Lava burst. That's not good. That's a bad. Oh shite. <laughs> um, so he wins next turn unless I draw something amazing and uh no, I don't. Well played. Okay. So I think that trying to get my Frothing Berserker thing out at the beginning was probably a bit of a mistake. If I get Frothing Berserker in my opening hand again, I'm not going to bother with him. Uh, but also, the Shaman did have a lot of removal. Come on. Screw you, I'm conceding if you're going to spend that long. Well, uh, that didn't go so well, did it? <laughs> um, let's go back into another match and hopefully do a bit better. That's a bit, a bit embarrassing. Um, yeah. So we got seventy two drops. I'm gonna try and take advantage of that and not try and get any fancy combos. But if the combos come to us, then take advantage of it. It's probably a mistake put doing inner rage, rampage on the guy. On Throthing Berserker. I could have saved them for something else. Oh well. Garrosh versus Anduin. Anduin. The light shall bring victory. Okay. Victory or death. Should probably get rid of the Raging Wargon. Really? What do we get? Uh, not brilliant. Actually, we don't have any turn one plays, do we? So. Yeah, um, probably best to go Acidic Swampoo's turn one. The Fiery War Axe isn't bad either. Let's see what he sends out. Direwolf, yeah, Fiery War Axe is better here. Um, then Acidic Swampoo's next turn, or maybe Emperor Cobra. What have we got? Light well. Ah, excellent. Perfect for the Emperor Cobra. And he's going to have to, like, really remove it if he wants. He needs to focus on removing this Cobra if he wants to keep his light well. Uh, Twilight Drake next turn for a pseudo. Oh, he can't do it. Twilight Drake for a pseudo. Um, what's it called? Pseudo. Pseudo, pseudo, pseudo. Yeti. It's going to be a 4-5, I think. Yep. 
Then we're going to hold on to our axe just in case we need to remove something. <clears throat> Next turn, probably Silverhand Knight. Although if he has a big threat up, I go Iron Fur Grizzly instead. Okay. Okay, that's fine. So I'll go Silverhand Knight here. Yeah, that's best. And we still got our pseudo Yeti up. Twilight Drake is actually a pretty good card, because it's pretty common by turn four you've got five cards in your hand. And it's got potential to be even better than the Yeti, but it's got potential to be pretty bad also. Okay, what do we want? Um, shit, if only that was a slightly higher health minion, I could reap a bunch of card draw from it. Um, okay, so, the best thing to do here is this. Because it will keep these two guys alive. And now... I'll bring out my taunt just to keep, try and keep them safe for a little bit. Hopefully, he doesn't have anything that can do a ton of damage. I mean, his holy Nova thing would kill off half my board, but you know, mind games. What's he gonna get? I don't have anything especially brilliant that he could bring out. Yeah, Cool Taskmaster, pretty lame. Mind Vision. Um, luckily, oh fuck, he could, he might have got the Swamp Poo, so I have to be really careful about using weapons now. Uh, okay. Do we want to go, Cult Master? Actually, how much do we have the Vic? No, we've almost got victory. Well, we've got six, ten. Oh no, we do. We do have one. Well played. So that was a much better match. Uh, I think if I focus on just trying to get a bunch of minions out and controlling the board, we're going to do better than fucking around with those stupid combos. Anyway, thanks for watching. Uh, we'll see you next time with this lovely warrior deck. Bye bye.